Hi, my name is Chris Dim, IFBB Pro. I'm shooting my fourth video. So those of you who have not seen my last three video, go back on there. Um, you can go to YouTube and, and uh, punch Chris Dim, IFBB Pro, and um, you'll actually go into the YouTube channel. You can actually see all the three videos. Really, really impactful. First one talks about what happened to me, how I became into uh, with my spinal cord accident. So those of you that have a lot of questions that what happened to Chris, Go back and watch the first one. The first one, you'll, you'll like it. It'll say Chris Dim Paralyzed on there. And then the second one, I talk about, um, I talk about my battle scar. I talk about you know, um, the scars that we have, everything in life. We have battle scars. Really, really impactful. Third one, I talk about uh, belief. Belief is everything. And if, without belief, it's not going to happen. Nothing's going to happen. And then the fourth thing that, that I'm going to talk about today is I'm going to talk about a burning desire. Burning desire is everything because without a burning desire, we're not going to do anything. We're not going to get up off the bed. We're not going go to get to the gym. We're not going to go ahead and, 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 and do anything without a burning desire. So burning desire is connected to what we call the why. The why is everything. So, so a lot of time we say, you know, what is a burning desire? Burning desire is connected to uh, 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 why. Why do we do certain things? If we don't have a strong enough why, we're not going to move. We're not going to do anything. We sit there and we're just still, right? So burning desire connected to the why. You know, a lot of people go, why, why, why? Well, let me give you my why. Maybe that might give you a little help. Um, remember, I came down as a refugee from Cambodia. My, my mom um, used to work for the Khmer Rouge. Well, not work, but also didn't have a choice. She had to, so a slave, how's that? And uh, she had to work for them. Or in in the middle of the night, my mom would steal potatoes and she'd she'd cook them and she would put it in our mouth. And we wouldn't make a peep a sound. And she said, "You know, you guys are so good." I was about four years old, five years old. And the next day, they would line my mom up, and they would said, "Somebody's been stealing potatoes. If I catch who it is, I'm gonna cut your head off." So my mom is my burning desire for everything because she's at an age right now in her life. I want to treat her like a queen. I want to give her everything in life. I want to roll out the red carpet for her because I realize that, you know, that's my hero. That's my why, you know. So because of that alone, in the situation that I'm in, you know, uh, you know, of course, you know, you feel like you've been stopping your track when you're going 110 miles an hour, then all suddenly you go in for surgery and you come out with a spinal cord injury. You really, literally got stopped in your track. And uh, at that point, my desire to push, my why is my mom, because I understand I have to walk. That's the mental picture that I put into my head. What is your why for you to burn to get you to do these things? Is it your, 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 your kids? Is it your, uh, you know, you have these goals of having that mansion, or is it helping people? You know, you wanna help the world. Is it, is it, no matter what it is, what is your why? What's gonna get you to push? But I don't want you to just think about it, I want you to write it. Write that why down, because without you writing that why, whatever, that mental picture of looking at it every single day, pushing you to get up every morning, you don't look at that why and you're gonna get up, because that why is gonna force you to get up and it's gonna force you to push. You know, what is it? So because that why is gonna be so strong, you're not gonna think about anything else, because if your why is bigger than your fear, you're gonna get up and move. What, you know, you're not going to fear anything. You're going to be that Superman. You're going to be so strong and so powerful. You're going to be like, you know, I'm ready to take on the whole world. So because of that, what is your why? What is your burning desire for that why to really, really connect? And if you figure that out, that's the reason why I'm going to walk. I have a mental picture in my head that I'm walking 100%. I'm doing leg press 100%. And there's nothing is going to block me because I don't believe in blockage. You can go over it, you can go under it, you can go around it, you can go, you can do whatever you need to do. You know, just because a tree is, is blocking your, 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 your track right now, you can take another route to, to, take, to, to take, that, take that why and get it done. So what is your why? What is your burning desire? Let's get that done. Okay, so you know, uh, my thing is, is my burning desire, my why is so strong because the reason why it's so strong for me right now is because I know 
Me, I'm a believer. Whether you're believing or not, I'm a huge believer. And I believe through God, through Christ, myself. You don't have to believe me. Everyone's got their own, okay? That I believe that He's going to give me the, the strength. He's going to give me the power. He's going to give me the courage. He's going to give me everything that I need to be that Superman, to be that superhero, to, to finish off whatever task that I'm out there to get. Other than that, you know what? I love you guys. God bless. If you want, go on to my uh, Chris Dem IFBB Pro uh, fan page. Click like. Let's share this video. Let's get it out to the whole world. Let's inspire more people. Let's pick more people up. Because you know what? That's what our job is here to do. Our job is to give back. Our job is to help other people. Because remember, the more helping people that you do, the more blessing you're going to get on the back end. If you don't expect that blessing to come, it's going to come anyway. Other than that, you know, God bless you. I love you guys. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Thank you.